This tutorial will show you how to use Plicker's student response system in your classroom. The first step is going to be to go to Plickers.com and print out your Plicker cards. You can just click on the standard Plickers card set and go ahead and print those out. You may want to laminate them if you're going to be using them over and over. The second step will be to sign up for a Plickers account. Since I've already done that, I'm going to go ahead and sign in. And it will automatically take you to the classes page. From here, if it's your first time using it, you're going to go ahead and add a new class. From here, if you have student numbers, you're going to go ahead and start entering those students in. And it will automatically assign them a clicker based on the order that you enter them in. Once you have all of your students entered in, you can head over to the library and begin creating questions. You can choose between multiple choice and true false. Just be sure that you also put the correct answer, check the correct answer. From there, you can add it to a plan. So right now, if I just want my test class to be answering this question, I can go ahead and click that class. You can add it to several classes. If you are a secondary teacher that teaches several different classes throughout the day, you can add that question to as many classes as you would like. From there, you will probably want to go ahead and download the Flickers app. And if you go to the main Plickers page, there is a link that will take you automatically to the App Store and the Google Play Store to get those put on your devices. With that um, app, that is how you're going to actually use the camera to scan your class as they hold up the Plicker cards. So when you're ready, you can go to Live View. And um, to switch to a new question, change which question your mobile app is viewing to see it change here. So you're going to want to use your mobile device to actually select the question that you want to show up in Live View. From here, as you scan your students, you will see that the boxes will be checked to show that they've answered so they can then bring down um, their Plicker card. They don't have to keep showing it up. You can show the answers if you'd like. Um, and once all of the students have answered, you can also click on graph to show them um, how many people in the class have gotten it right. The powerful part of click Clickers is that you can actually head into reports once you're finished and click on the question to get a breakdown of how all of your students did um, and how your class did as a whole.